Hi, I'm Jen Hansen. I teach sixth grade social studies and English at Owatonna Middle School in Owatonna, Minnesota. So we use the Northern Lights curriculum and it just embeds itself beautifully into using that curriculum um, because it talks all about Minnesota, where we live. Uh, talks about places like right here in Steele County in Owatonna. Um, loved an article a while back on Bushel Boy Tomatoes. So the kids were like, that's right here, we know that. I've got parents that work there. Um, but it's, it's, it just really highlights for the kids that they are introduced to agriculture every minute of every day. If it's the paper in the book, the ink on the pages of their book, uh, the clothing that they are wearing, the food that they are eating, um, the chapstick that they are using that has a soybean base, it's involved in their everyday life. And they learn that by using the Ag Mag um, and reading that. Uh, they love to read it. Um, we usually do some activities with it. And then at the end, they love we have an Ag Mag feud. So we have the farm versus the city. And the kids um, love to play Ag Mag feud. So um, love also that it is nonfiction because so much of what um, we are trying to do with our English ELA standards is working with nonfiction. And the Ag Mag brings nonfiction um, right here. It's a piece that they can actually interact with. So kids are able to highlight, underline, annotate, um, jot down um, pieces right on the Ag Mag because they get to keep it. Uh, I have also had kids say, hey, can I bring this home to my parents? And I've had parents who have come into conferences and said, hey, love that Ag Mag. They are Ag families, farm families, um, and they love seeing that their kids are getting something that relates to their home life. Um, and it also gives those, those farm families a chance to kind of shine in the classroom. So love using the Ag Mag. It's free to teachers. Um, what's better than that?